Lost Within Himself by Andrew Powell Part 1 From the Outside Looking In Before me the mirror glistens, on my knees forever wishing that the other me would ever listen and show me some reflective wisdom. Unanswered questions leave me guessing, crushed and messy, between issues unrelenting and together pressing. Neither me will learn life's lesson, that pallid face continues stressing. Bluffed by retrospect, the deeper depths make life depressing. I yearn to dream, to peer and lean into that rink of chrome, but the seeds are sown. The stream is flowing, fate a toiling path through the unknown, within the ripple of a shimmer. My face begins to wither, the surface dances with a diver, convexes with a quiver, clasped in invisible hands and wrenched into the silver waters of that river. I sit, staring back at myself, caged, helpless, now within the mirror. Part 2. From the inside looking out. He raises a shaking hand towards his jowls, caresses, astounded, feels around. I found a power so profound rendered me a mime. He puts it down, and so do I, for I mimicked every sign, unable to resist. Yet I feel, I breathe, I live, but only on his shoulders am I now able to exist, and to think, for this I often wished, to be the one within looking back. Now I'm fully able and intact, but liberty has fallen just outside my grasp, if he was to leave, my world would grow black, paraplegic to that hideous fact that my existence is now restricted to cloning his axe and portraying him back. A darkle vaguely sparkles in my punctilious gaze, sealed behind his coy face. His smile is nave, a grin that sears. Within, he will now enjoy his days. The moral comes to pass that the grass is not always greener on the other side. Here I will remain trapped. Alas, perhaps in truth, he will be a better me than I.